Hey guys, welcome back. Today we're going to be talking about something interesting. It's very basic, but I've observed that a lot of you guys don't know what these terms are. So when you see it on a stream or when you see it during coaching, you're confused that what does it mean and you cannot follow. So well, today I'm going to be just giving a brief on what the terms mean. So the first term that we're going to talk about today is monotone. A monotone is basically a board when the three cards on the flop open up and all of them are of the same suit. Example, Ace King Jack of Hearts. Three Five Two of Hearts. So example, when all the cards that open up on the flop are of the same suit, that's a monotone board. Now let's talk about term two, Rainbow Board. Rainbow Board is when all three cards that open up on the flop are of a different suit. Example, Ace King Jack of Spades, Diamonds and Clubs. So here what you're seeing is, it's all different suits. The third term that we're going to be talking about is open. What does an open mean? Open basically means that the first person to bet in a hand is called open. Example, I was from the UTG position and I decided to open to two and a half bigs. That is basically the first person to bet in a hand is basically called opening the hand. Next is limping. Limping is basically that bet that you make that you just call a particular open or you just decide to put in the minimum blinds. Example, the big blind just decided to limp in basically would mean that if there was an open before or a call or a raise before, you just decide to call it. In case you decide to raise it, that would be something else. But limping is basically just calling enough. Shoving. This is more of a slang for all in, but what a shove usually means is basically I have decided to put all my chips into the pot and that's why it's called a shove or a jam. The next thing is out of position and in position. In position usually means that you are in such a spot where all other players have to act before you and you are the last person to act. So you get all information that okay how other people have played in this hand and that's why it's advantageous to be in position. Out of position is where you have to act first and the other opponent has to act after you. So you are out of position versus them and this is a disadvantageous position because you have to act first so you don't get the, uh, the benefit of knowing what the other person is going to do. In post flop, UTG is basically out of position because they have to act first and the big blind is in position because they get to act last. Well, this is part one of a few basic terms that you need to take care of. I'm not mixing you up with a lot of terms in this video. These five, six terms are something which you should just watch the video again, understand what they mean. So next time when you see it on stream, you are completely aware of what a streamer or what a coach is talking about. Thank you.